Hello everyone, I am Aniket and I, I know I haven't uploaded a lot of uh, video for a lot of time and uh, so the last video I uploaded was in December 2022 on, 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 which was removed by Colchef, I don't know why but just, let's just move on to the topic of the video so this is kind of an update video and also tips for becoming expert on code courses so I recently become expert uh, I solved uh, four problems in uh, the previous uh, finally round two and gained a plus 82 and became expert so uh, so I, this video contains so in this video I will tell you what topics do you need to do for becoming expert on code courses so it will be my personal experience which topics I know I will suggest them so for becoming let's uh, talk about contests for becoming expert you need to solve at least uh, three questions uh, consistently in normal due to round for uh, as you can see I have solved three uh, most of the times I have solved three questions uh, in normal due to round and sometimes I also solved uh, two and sometimes I also solved four but most of the times I solved three questions and uh, three questions are enough to become uh, expert on code courses also you need to consider the difficulty uh, difficulty of problem C if the problem C is easy you need to solve it fast uh, so as you can see in this contest I solved three but uh, the third problem was uh, easier than normal deuteron so my rank is 3435 I couldn't solve it faster so so yeah if the problem difficulty of the problem is less you have to also maintain the speed and if sometimes the question D is also easier than normal uh, deuteron so you have uh, in that context you have to solve the D question as well for example in this contest I solved four questions and the fourth question was uh, pretty simple as compared to other contests for because and there are 6000 submissions for this uh, problem and I solved all the questions uh, pretty faster so uh, I gained my rating as you can see I solved all four questions in 57 minutes without uh, wrong submission so if D is easy you have to solve it faster and let's move on to the topics you should know for becoming expert for to become expert so for problem A you need to have uh, a good grasp on solving implementation problems and you have to solve them fast uh, very fastly so you can move so you can move on to next questions so a is based on implementation sometimes a little bit math is added but most of the times it is it will be based on implementation and a simple logic will be given to you and the rating of this problem generally lies in 800 to 1000 and next is b problem so b problem will be again based on math some math implementation sometimes it has constructed algorithms it is off topic constructed algorithm and also there is number theory it will be based on prime number some logic of prime number and yeah most of the times this uh, also sometimes it will be on based on data structure so a standard stack problem or uh, queue problem will be there so you have to master these topics and the, the uh, difficulty range of B problem lies in 1000 to 1200 it will be rare that it is uh, higher than 1200 but most of the times it will be between it will be less than 1200 now the C problem so the C problem will be based on greedy and constructive most of the times greedy and constructive and also you need to master binary search for solving C problem uh, specifically binary search on answer so you need to practice uh, this uh, this type of uh, binary search questions 
and for that uh, you can follow this uh, PP series of Striver. So in this there are topics. You can also solve the implementation and constructive problems. If you feel that questions are a lot easy, you can skip four to five questions and move on faster. And there are also match questions which you can follow. But the final search questions are very good. I have solved. Uh, I solved till here. Uh, I solved. I started solving uh, till hard, and it helped a lot. Final search questions are there. Mo in most of the C's, the topic will be binary search. So as you can see, this C question is of binary search. D1, C, B, and in medium section as you can see, the questions are of C, C, C. So binary search is important to solve uh, due to C. And for constructive and greedy, you just need to practice a lot of questions in the range 1400 to 1600. And if you practice those uh, those rating questions, you will uh, you will probably solve due to C questions consistently. And some people say DP is also needed for uh, solving due to C, but I don't think so because I haven't solved a single DP question during a contest on Code for You. I have practiced a lot of questions, but I haven't solved a single DP question in. Uh, live contest of code forces so it is not mandatory so it might uh, it might work for you also it might not but uh, probably don't need dp Mo most of the dp is asked in fourth question so dp if you learn dp you can become expert faster but for becoming expert you don't need dp so but dp is important topic you should learn it and so for next for practicing the top uh, rating ranges you can use this c2 ladder i also use it so as you can see for 1600 i solved 56 problems i'm currently solving 1700 and 1800 problems so this is an helpful ladder this contains variety of questions and variety of topics also so you can give it a try and also this CSCS problem set for solving topic wise questions so as you can see I am currently solving uh, DP problems and you need to uh, consistently participate in contest How, whatever happens part do participate in contest I barely missed a few contests but I have given all the contests as you can see I have given around 109 contest so it is important to participate in every contest don't think about the rating just participate so you can practice more questions and i guess that's it for today if you have any doubt you can just put it in the comment section if you want a video editor of any specific question you can just put the link of the question in the comment section and i will try to make a video editorial for that video and also try to upload a tutorials for next contest so i will try that and there is a telegram link in the uh, telegram link in the description so you can join that group and ask me doubts personally so that's it from my side thank you